Hello everybody, it is Chris and welcome back to uh, another StarCraft 2 game. Now if you look at the minimap, you notice that there are some significantly significant differences in what's going on. And this is actually kind of ironic because if you look, my ally is also top this. See? See? Right there, right there. So I'm just going to reply to him real quick. Yes, I have played the Marine or er, Marine Arena. It's an okay game. Okay, anyway. If you actually kind of whoa, yeah. Um Okay. If you actually been looking at the chat cuz it's kind of hard not to notice. We actually played these three people. Um Thanatos, Eggroll, and Alex above all in our um spelling fail in our placement matches when we were doing threes and based on what we see top this doing that kind of that kind of tells you what the entire game is going to go like um top this is going a six pool so he's basically going to rush and if that's kind of in any inclination in what the game is going guess what me and sen do yeah, we're gonna cannon rush. But anyway, okay, before I get into that, it is me as the purple Protoss, top this as the orange Zerg, um, Xen as the uh, yellow Protoss, can't tell my colors, Thanatos as the Cyan Terran, Eggroll as the blue Terran, and then Alex above all as the red Protoss. But anyway, we were actually playing a bunch of threes, and we kind of got tired of playing in all seriousness. So, this game, we kind of decided, you know what, we're just going to cheese fest this. So, I'm starting my cannon rush. And Egg Roll, he, he's starting to try and stop it, but he's not doing that great of a job. Then finally his SCVs should start coming, yeah, here they come if you didn't see the clicking. These SCV should actually continue to attack. But I actually never allowed him to finish his supply depots, which is actually kind of funny, because that prevents him from building anything else, really. But, okay, so I'm starting my cannon rush. My first cannon is going up, and then top this is Zerglings come in. And then they just start picking off the F SCVs, which kind of negates my entire cannon rush. But, oh well. And then here goes Sen with his cannon rush. He, um, he kind of doesn't do his as well. Because, in my opinion, he places this a little too far out. Yeah, in our placement match, Eggroll did the exact same thing to me. Except I was able to survive it. All I did was stockpile minerals and make a new base. And I was actually able to beat him, even though he cannon rushed. And we did end up winning our placement match, too. But, okay, in my cannon rush, this is where I learned that cannon rushing a Terran is not that great of an idea. For this reason. He just lifts off his command center. And I, being the pro player I am, do not notice the command center flying away. So I continue to invest more minerals into my cannon rush, until finally I end up noticing, wait a minute, he is gone. He is long gone. And then, here goes Alex above all. Yeah, I, I, I love his smack talk. It's kind of funny since he was Protoss, yet we did beat him before. But that's not the point. Anyway, so Alex above all, he is being, he's turtling. I, I think you can use that to any race. Turtling, if I'm right, is basically hiding in your shell. Which is basically hiding in your base. I hope I use that definition right. Um, Thanatos does end up leaving. Because he basically loses all of his SCVs except for like four. <laughs> One's in the red. And then I think his teammates actually start taking over. Or they took over his base. If they were quicker, they could have saved these two barracks and 
Actually, they do save the command center, so I will give them that. They could have saved the two barracks. But yeah, Sen's cannon rush kind of doesn't go over so well. Nothing really happens. Um, uh, Egg Rule has landed. He has plenty of minerals, so he can actually get started again, which is exactly what he does. And then I'm very slow to go back into kind of my standard play. As you can see, I have very few probes. Um, actually, production... Uh, army, no. No, resources. What's army? No, crap. Units, that's what I want. Okay. So, top of this actually has the most units for now. Um, Vendos has four SCVs. Uh, Egg Roll is getting, has two. Alex above all, above all has 17, and then me and Sen both have nine. And I'm really actually, I'm really slow in getting back into the groove of things. So I just kind of, I trap Alex above all to make sure he's not going to move out. He, he's not going to do anything anytime soon. So I place a bunch of, I place a bunch of cannons and pylons right here. And then Egg Roll, he, Egg, Egg Roll compliments me on my cannon rush, because cannon rush takes such, takes such a great amount of skill. But... And then here we have, um, top this is Zerglings. They're just running around. They're scouting for Zan uh, Thanatos's stuff, basically. They're looking for his, where he put his command center. And based on where they're going now, they find it. Because it is right here. And his Zerglings are right here. So yeah, that, do that does not, that does not equate a long life for this command center. And then, you know, that is a lot of minerals and nothing is going on. I think top this is just putting way too much too way too much into his um zergling micro. And Thanatos is officially out of this game cuz he has nothing left. But anyway, Eggroll is trying to basically build back up. Um I'm just being a ditz and not doing anything. Um meanwhile, uh Sen has actually gotten his gateway out. Um, top of this is being a dit to not doing anything, but he does have these zerglings to basically harass with, but, uh, I really don't think they're getting through this great wall of cannonness. So, we decide, okay, we're gonna start looking for the other Terran, Eggroll, and, as you can tell, based on the path these zerglings are taking, this is not long for life. So he's tr he's trying to basically build himself back into this game. And I get this genius idea. I, I feel so smart for actually thinking of this. I decide, wait, if I place a pylon here, I can actually put a cannon up on the high ground. I can put a cannon here, and then I can get up and put a cannon on the high ground. And then I remembered, wait a minute. There is no way in hell my probe is getting through that. I thought I could just like long distance place something up here, and I was wrong. I w I was very very wrong. But anyway, hey, he finally did an inject larva. Oh my god, that is so many minerals, and he's not producing anything. Okay, I do have my gateway up, and then uh, blah, 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 what can I do here? I'm just gonna keep it everyone. You know what, I'm gonna go health bars. Why not? M makes me feel better. Whoop, did not, did not want to do that. Close. Okay, sorry about that. I was actually looking for something. Oh, it's over here. Okay. So Alex above all, he's trying to basically build himself back into this. He, he, he's pretty confident that, you know, they haven't got, they don't got, me speak good English. They do not have much. Um, they maybe they probably only have these zerglings, and then maybe a few units. So if I can just produce a bunch of units, I should be okay. I should be able to actually maybe pull this out for my team. Um, what's he producing over here? He oh robotics. Oh yeah, there are colossus in this game. I feel like a douchebag for not remembering. No wait, douchebag is wrong term. Um, idiot. That that is a more correct more proper term. 
you know what, don't judge me. As... I, I Actually, I think it's Sen who would say that. Though it's actually going to be top this, and he's going to get pissed at me. But we're actually talking on um, Ventrilo, or Vent, so we kind of know what we're all going to do. We're just kind of talking and laughing and joking around. We're having a good game. We're having a good time with this game. And then Sen gets the brilliant idea to do something really crazy right here. Bes besides all the craziness that's already been going on, he decides to do something that's insane. And then top of this is doing playing around with his Zerglings. That just sounded really wrong. And then we figure out, wait a minute, Marine's there, we know where he is. Yeah, I, I still produce a cannon there for no real reason. And yet, I have almost, why do I have almost nothing? I have like no minerals. Oh, because I'm not producing SCVs. I still, er, I still have nine probes. I'm such a pro player. But then, wait a minute, okay, his Marines were there, so he is here. Which, he's actually doing quite well at the high yield. And then, instead of doing this, what I would have done, I would have loaded up a bunch of SCVs, and then moved what's left away, lift this off, lift these off, and then probably just try and, like, maybe land in my allies' base, 